Hi guys, welcome to Sunday with me and Chippy. Um, I've been away for a couple of weeks, which I will address in another video, but starting off, I wanted to start off today's videos with this affordable, very affordable and budget friendly wig that I picked up. Um, I ordered it. <laughs> tell you the truth, so much has been going on here lately that I can't remember exactly where I ordered it. Maybe it was Glamour Tress or Ebony Line or I just can't remember. But um, I did order her. She is from the Ascara line of Bobby Boss Wigs. And the reason that I ended up ordering this was because I saw a video review that Kim Stam had posted and I would put the link to her video but as an ex-New Yorker I don't want to get sued so I'll put a link to the video instead um she might not want to be associated with me and I don't know maybe I don't blame her but anyway <laughs> This is a great wig. This is the Athena wig. And I, I am so glad that I ordered it, but I'm not crazy about this color. And this is why reviews are so important. I picked out this color based on a small little square which I thought would be darker, but it it's not. This is the shade Almond Spice. Um, it is T, let me read it to you. It is T81622. And here it is on the stock card. Um, it does, like it came out a little darker on the stock stock card so when I opened up the box and saw her I was like whoa this is really blonde but it doesn't mean that I'm not going to wear her I think with the tan in the summer and just coming back from the beach this is a great wig in fact I plan on ordering another one in a darker color hopefully it'll be the right dark slash light shade. But anyway, let me get into this. Um, Ascara is a line of Bobby Boss wigs. I like the wigs because they aren't as dense as the regular line. Um, I think that they're more geared, and I, trust me, I don't want to say this, I think they're more geared like the mature woman and yes this is long but it's really really nice because it's long but it's not too long it just grazes past the shoulders and I think it is a lovely lovely length but anyway she came in this box which you know that I'm big on boxes for storing my wigs she was very well secured with tissue paper we got the foam she came all dressed up in a net. So she was on par with your more um, expensive wigs as far as delivery and as far as the way that she was protected in the package. So again, here's the stock card. She has a four inch deep part. She is a lace front. Um, hold on. I have to get Chippy because he is eating a blanket. Hold on. I don't know what it is with him, but he's like an overgrown child. Hold on. I'm, I'm going to have to... I'm going to have to pause this, so hold on. You can see things don't really change. I've been away for a couple of weeks. I'm back, and it's the same old, same old. Hold on. Okay, I'm back. Honestly, you should have been in my house last night. I made a Moroccan pie, a bastilla, for dinner, 
and you have to work with phyllo dough and puff pastry, uh, not puff pastry, just phyllo dough. When I was carefully unwrapping the sheets and placing them into the spring form pan and brushing them with butter, he took off with one of the sheets. Like it was like a comedy of errors. I had to run after him to get the sheet. He went into the living room. He started eating the sheet and all these little pieces of like phyllo dough were falling all over the place. Then the Frenchman came in. He saw the little pieces. He started freaking out because he had just vacuumed. So it was, it was insanity. And it's just the three of us, me, my husband, and Chippy. It's insane. My house was calmer when I had three kids living at home. But anyway, let's get back to the review and the fact that Chippy is now eating the stock corn. See that? Thank you. Thank you. My, my, my assistant. Look at this. I'm not playing tug of war with him. Okay, now that he's managed to chew on my favorite Bobby Boss model, here is the stock card for the Athena wig. I think she looks better in person. She really does. Like she is soft as all get out without, how can I put this? She's really soft and silky, but I know that over time, the shine and the silkiness will dull to give it a more natural appearance, which is great. So I am going to turn around from side to side and the back to show you just how Athena looks, okay? Now, here is my right side. And as you can see, she really is a great length. She's long, but not too long. Here she is from the back. And hold on, I have to go get um, the stock card from Chippy. Hold on. Give me that. Give me that. Hold on, here I am. Okay, I'm back. Oh, God. Now you know why I only have like 10 followers. But anyway, you did see how she moves when I ran after Chippy. So <laughs> here's my left side, okay? Here we go. Like she really, I'm telling you, this is really an excellent wig. Now, do I have to manipulate her? Hold on a second. The only manipulation that I plan on doing with this is just steaming the top just a tad so that she doesn't fall down into my face. But look, here's the lace, the lace front part. I mean, this is really an excellent wig. And it was like less than, I paid less than $35. So let me take her off. Here's the, here's the inside. There's some comfortable felt slash lace at the nape. We have the bra strap, adjustable straps. Here's the lace front with this deep part. And let me tell you something, as a woman who wears glasses, these ear tabs are ridiculously, ridiculously comfortable. Now, this definitely fits an average to larger size head. And this is comfortable as all get out. See, we have the under color, the darker color underneath, which goes into lighter without being an ombre. Now, another thing, when I first tried her on, she did shed a bit, but after that initial shedding, she stopped. 
Hold on, I'm gonna put her back on. I mean, I have to say, I really, really do like this a lot. And I hope that the next one that I order, the color definitely is a more cool, darker tone. But one thing, after the initial shedding, as I said, she stopped shedding. But at first, when I took her out of the box and she was shedding, I was in a complete and utter state of joy because, you know, I do have trick. So pulling just feeds my habit and oh, it felt good, but she's no longer shedding. And I have to say, overall, this Bobby Boss Ascara wig that Chippy basically fell in love with the Bobby Boss model, as do we all, she's the cutest thing in the world, but this is a great great, great deal for the money. There is no permatease. So if you do not like permatease, this is a great, great wig for you. As I said, there is a lower density with this wig. She's still thick enough that you're not going to see the wefts, but the density is low enough that during the summer, this is definitely going to be one cool wig. Honestly, this is going to be that wig that you can wear when the humidity reaches like 200 and the temperature reaches 100. So overall, I have to say for an affordable wig, this Ascara wig um, from Bobby Boss, the name is Athena. This overall is a great, great wig. And I want to thank Kim Stam for her wonderful review on this. Um, as I said, I'll put a link down to her review because trust me, her review is a hell of a lot better than mine. Um, you can't go, you, you honestly, you can't go wrong with a wig like this. And the fact that it's affordable makes it 10 times better because this is the wig that you can wear in crappy weather that you're not gonna care about. You're not gonna say, oh my God, I spent so much money on this wig and it's raining out. No, that's not going to happen. And all you have to do when you get back home, if it's raining, is turn her upside down and dry her. Honestly, overall, this is really, really, really a great wig. And as I said, after I finish doing the videos today, I am going to go online and check for a darker color so that I can have this in a darker color. That's it. Take care. Be well, be safe, and have a great day. I will be back later. Now, let me figure out how to close out. Bye now. Take care.